Hey guys, I am back with a new World of Kings video and today we are going to be talking about something that people are freaking out over like crazy and uh, they don't understand like what's happening, how they're supposed to finish the T1 or T2 gear and so on. So I'm going to go through everything so you guys don't need to panic or anything because uh, they didn't remove anything except the, the coupons and the rate and the, the drops from the old adventures. Normals. The reason they did that is so you guys run the new content because if they if they did remove it you guys would just be running the old content the new content dragon sky is very easy all right this is the new and it drops this coupon you can use this it drops 12 of these coupons and before i make everything more confusing let's just go through everybody if you guys make your down make your way down to this hall royal hall the main city talk to this gat man right here let's go to normal exchange real quick you go to normal exchange, so you see I have 15 coupons. I dropped 12 coupons from the Dragon Hall and I dropped 3 from the Hero. When I have 24, I can exchange this for the old coupons. So let's say you have old coupons stored up. You had like 100 coupons and you're like, man, I can't get the old gear. Yes, you can. You can still get tier 1. You just use the old, the new coupon that you get. You exchange it into the old coupon, which is like Edeon or Frost Moon or whatever it was, right? Exchange it into this. Bam, you will get 40 of these and when you finally have them, you talk to this guy again. You'll be like, hi, I want to do old world exchange. You click on whichever, was it shoulder, was it gloves, what was it? Was it frost moon? You buy the chest and you can get your tier 1 still. Okay, your tier 1 is still there. When it comes to tier 2, tier 2 is not out yet. Okay, tier 2 gear is not out. There's no way to get tier 2 gear. Because it's not out. This gear that you get here, this is for tier 1 that you used to have. And it is what you need to exchange it to tier 2 later. When the tier 2 finally comes out. How you can do that, I will show you guys right now. Alright, click on your inventory. You click on your set. Here's the sets. When you have the set, it says tier 1, tier 1. Just like old times, you get the new, you get this, you drop it from the new one. Or you buy it from the NPC and you get these materials and you make your tier 1. And then there's tier 2. Now, what you can do, if you already have the tier, tier 1 like I do, then you only need to drop the tier 2. This will come in the new raid, the adventure raids, in probably a couple of weeks. So you will drop these and then you use this, and use this to upgrade it to tier 2 if you want the tier 2. So for some classes tier 1 is still better. So classes you want to get the tier 2. And then, as you can see, I don't have the helmet. I only have 5 pieces of T1. So how do I get the helmet if I want the helmet? Alright? What I will do is I will go to set. Alright? I will go here. I will get this helmet through the coupons. So let's say I have the blue coupons, which I have right now. I will get the blue coupons. I will exchange the blue coupons for the frost moon. I will get 200. Then I will talk to this man again. I will click on uh I will click on the world exchange. I will click on Frost Moon and I will get the helmet. Which one is the helmet? This is the helmet right here. So I will get the helmet, and once I have the helmet, I will go back to this, back to set, back to T2, and then I finally have the helmet. All I need to do is get the tier 2 or helmet from the drop, and then I can make that into the T2. Boom! Very easy, very straightforward. Alright, now, the game added something really cool. Alright, really freaking cool. Alright, let's say you are a dragon rider. I'm a dragon rider. Let's say I want to change to any of the knight classes, like a cleric or a bard, right? Let's say I want to change to a bard, right? What I can do is, I can get all my tier 1 gear, I can put it off, right here, bam. Take it off, take this one off, take this one, I click on dismantle, I click on the dismantling of my T1. Now when I do this, I will get, because I, my gear level is high, right? So I get drag magic crystals back so I can level it up uh, when I'm done. And I get the T1 uncrafted, I get this piece. Now when I get this piece, I'm not going to dismantle because obviously I'm not going to switch. I talk to this man again. I click on Adventure Gear Exchange. No, no, not this one. Sorry, sorry. I apologize, I apologize. 
uh, old world I think is the exchange old world exchange no 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 this one right where is it am I set conversion sorry sorry set conversion I apologize it's on the bottom one set conversion now when I have this I, I dismantle it. I got this one back. I need to get this. You get it from in here for 30 gold from the shop. Once you get it, you can exchange it for this chest. And this chest, as you can see here, it it includes the warrior, the, the heavy gear. It includes the bard gear, the ranger gear, and it includes the healer gear. So you can do that. You can completely switch your class. And you can switch your full T1 set to whatever class. And you can do this for Templar too, if you want to switch to Templar from a Dragon Rider, you can switch it to the Templar gear. You can switch it to the Inquisitor gear. You can switch it to the Bard gear, to the Demon Hunter gear, to whatever class you want to play. If you don't want to play your class anymore, they literally let you switch your T1 to whichever gear you want to by just paying 30 extra gold. Alright, because it's completely free to dismantle. And you can do that if you're a Cloth, you can dismantle it and turn into a Warrior, a Paladin I mean, or a Bard, and so on. It will let you, let you literally choose whichever class you want for free pays 30 extra gold per piece unfortunately uh but if you want to make a switch of course it's going to be it's going to cost you and then you just go to skills you go to transfer and you'll be like hey i want to be a light bringer boom cross class transfer switch class switch my t1 you can switch your weapon to let's say you go to uh legendary bam all right i don't want to be i don't want to have this anymore i want to be a light bringer right what I will do is I'll go for the book, convert, bam, all right, I'll buy, I need to buy 11 of these, but they're free to play crystals, I buy them, boom, 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 and I pay this 3,000 uh, diamonds, get that heal offhand, and I am a line bringer, you know? So this game literally, this update literally lets you play any class you want now from the nine trees that you have chosen, switch your gear as you want. The thing, you can still get your T1, I don't know why people are panicking just because they're not in the old ones. You guys have to understand, the reason they did this, the reason they removed the T1, is so you run the new content. Because there's no point in running the new content, and it's very easy, this boss is very easy. We cleared it in 5 minutes, it's super easy, you get these, you exchange it for whatever, it's, a lot of people have them saved up, so... If you go, I'll, I'll show you guys in a second. So basically, the other stuff that is here, is the revival adventure so when as you can see when you get the adventure when we get the adventure dragon sky then you can exchange it that's just when you get the tier two you see then you start getting the tier two you can't get the tier two yet but when you start it it's going to be the same thing all right uh i'm going to cost a lot of gold though damn can't be right bro 300 gold hell no there is no way they must. Have, they must. Have, they they're definitely gonna add a new way to get. There's no way you can, you're gonna pay four hundred gold just to exchange it into gear. But we'll see. We'll see. But that comes. Uh, that is basically the. This is the T two. It's not out yet. You can. You still some classes like he light bringers. I heard the T one is still better than the T two. So some classes don't even need the T two. And that's what you can do if you're like a free to play player. You can find out which class only need T one. Where the T2 set is not that great, and you can switch to that class, and you can just chill with T1 while everybody else is fighting for the tier 2. You know what I'm saying? It's very straightforward. And then they add something new, the Summit Challenge Exchange. I'm going to show you guys, because, you know, why not? This will come in the harder Overlords, probably Overlord like XXX, the hardest Overlord. Frost Moon, this is some hero, ray, uh, hero dungeons that will probably come in the future. Uh, yeah, here it says Overlord Doom Plus and higher difficulties. Frostman, Observatory bosses, not, they're not out yet, and you will be able to exchange these in for a 270 accessory weapon or uh, chest blade. But this is going to be like end game, like in a month or so. You don't have to worry. Just worry about the T1 for now. I will. Uh, so I hope that was very easily uh, explainable. I hope you guys now are not freaking out on how to get T1 and T2 and so on. Just make sure your guild is running these dungeons. Uh, the new ones literally I don't your guilds tell if you guys are still running Twilights and the D Edeons and stuff in your guild You need to tell them to stop all right you tell your guild to stop because it costs bigger and I don't know There's no need to run these for no reason 
because all the normal gear that like you can get better gear from other dungeons but that is for another video i'm gonna make a full gear guide video on weapons gear how you should be gearing up but this was just to explain you t1 and t2 so as you see i have a bunch of these still saved up right let me see what do i have here Let's see here i have a helmet where's this one edion Where's my, uh, where's my frost moon one? Is this frost moon? Yeah, so I have 140 frost moon. So if I want to get my helm, for example, I need 60 more. So I can literally use these new coupons right here and use them to get the last and then get my T1 helmet and so on. And if you don't want to do the two coupons, you can get them by buying this, this set right here. This works just like the old T1 and you just make that into the full piece that it gives you a set. Very straightforward. I hope this was helpful. I hope you guys are stressing a little bit now because everybody's freaking out. They're like, oh, these devs don't care. They're not giving us blah, blah, blah. I'm like, bro, you can still get everything chill. Everything is still, it's actually better now. I really like the system way more than the old one. It's way better. You can literally switch to anything you want and so on. It's perfect, in my opinion. Like, they're making, they made so much good changes, but a lot of people don't know about it. I think that's what people are freaking out about. Now, before I end this video, uh, Thank you guys so much for having me. Make sure you like and subscribe and follow me on Instagram and Twitch, all that stuff. Uh, and then, right here, or here, here, here? Let's do over here. Over here, I'm going to put a gift code. You can redeem the gift code. It's the first one, uh, whoever gets it. You click on gift code, you redeem it, boom, boom, and you get some free stuff, uh, you know? I'm going to be doing this uh, in uh, more videos, like posting gift codes in them. So make sure you guys watch the whole video. You know what I'm saying? I got you, man. Uh, you get some free diamonds and free uh, silver and so on. Uh, so you guys can keep gearing up. Thank you guys again so much for watching. Have a great evening, night. Uh, if you have any questions about the gear exchange or anything else that you guys want me to post, let me know. I got you, man. I, I'm trying to help you guys out so you guys make the gaming experience a little bit better for you guys. Uh, so any questions, just ask me. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you guys in the next video.